Hi. Uh, here's a, another psoriasis eczema video. And this one will cover poisonous plants and how they uh, cause people with psoriasis and eczema skin problems. All right. Well, the the cashew grows in a shell. All right, and that shell is uh, is very poisonous. It has a poisonous oil called cashew nut oil or something like that, and uh, it it's uh, it's pretty it's pretty toxic. So that's my point. Is I want to bring up the fact that there are few poisonous plants out there that that uh, could cause people with psoriasis and eczema problems. And cashews is one of them. All right. Psoriasis and eczema, peony, natural food poison video. Peony are skin conditions or symptoms from eating foods that have natural occurring plant poisons. Tomatoes, cherries, cashews, uh, to name three. Okay, there's, uh, there's at least seven or eight more. You might want to do a, a search on YouTube for poisonous foods that people love or eat and love. Rhubarb's one of them, if I remember right. Well, anyway, this madness of crazy skin conditions of peony has to change. The suffering people endure is incredible. And with a few simple pieces of information, proper food choice, all this suffering can be gone. Today's mechanized food system produces food that is profitable, tastes good, ahead of human suffering. Tomatoes produce suffering due to their naturally occurring poisons and have only been known to the human diet for 200 years. It's not very long, see now we've been on the earth for uh, two million years at least. Tomatoes come from a huge from huge fields and are eaten every day now. All right, then there's cherries. They come from orchards larger than the moon. Now that we have mechanization of uh, the food system, they contain arsenic, a natural poison. And cashews come from third world countries. I hate to say the word third world, but they come from less fortunate countries and grow on trees below a fruit the size of an apple and also contain a natural plant poisons. Do a search on cashews. Okay, See how they are grown and processed. Remember the best traits in food are not taste or value. The most important trait in food is, is the food sustainable food for your heritage and your body? Will your body and family thrive with the food? That's the most important part, point. Will your body and family thrive with the food? All right, well, this is where cashews are grown. Nigeria is the leading producer, what I read, but looks like uh, India is not far behind. All right, well, this is what the cashew apple looks like. And the nut grows below it right there inside of a shell, and the shell is poisonous. That's what it looks like growing on the tree. That's the shell of the nut of the cashew. Don't get me wrong, cashews taste great. I love them. They, but they're not good for you, I don't think. That's what they look like right when they harvest them there. And that's a that's a nice picture of them there. Okay, my three foods not to eat on this uh, video are tomatoes. See my other video on tomatoes. Uh, remember, they contain the two plant poisons that they use as pesticides, and. I'm sure they cause people with psoriasis problems. I'm absolutely positive they do. Cherries, they have that arsenic in the pit and the pit grows right next to the fruit. So I can't imagine that when you eat that cherry, you're not eating arsenic. And 
that's the final picture. Back to, to the uh, cashews. Uh, I, if I were you and I had psoriasis, I would get rid of those foods that uh, are suspect to being poisonous. It's probably a good a good start. Uh, and I hope uh, this helps you guys. Keep in touch, leave comments. I always appreciate your comments. All right, have a good one. Bye.